Milestar offered to tow the banana out to the Smoky Mountain Jeep Invasion, which was super nice of them. So if you'd like to meet the crew, we'll be at Pigeon Forge, Tennessee at the Smoky Mountain Jeep Invasion, the 25th, 26th, and 27th. Come by and say hi, check out the rigs. Both the Morver and the banana will be there. All right, good morning. It is a beautiful day. We're up here in American Fork. We brought our area expert, Tucker. This is where he grew up. So we're doing a job up American Fork Canyon, like past Tibble Fork. I don't know all the landmarks, Tucker. Mineral so, Basin area. We have got the banana and we've got the Morver and we've got an empty trailer somewhere. We're picking up a Lexus that has gone over the edge. If me and Skeeter look like we've been through the ringer, it's because we have. We were up all night on a job with Heavy D and we drove up here. We Climbing got... up and down cliffs. Yeah, it was crazy. <laughs> all right, we got up early this morning and drove all the way up here. By the time we got here, it was lunch. So we stopped and grabbed some lunch and then we realized we didn't bring any straps. So we had to go and get those. And now we're headed up to the Tibble Fork parking lot and we're gonna meet the customer up there. It's gonna be a great day. So what's the story on this? So I was driving on the trail and my front right dropped off and then I thought to gun it, which was not the move. And it ended up engaging the A-track and started to shimmy the back out towards this hill. And then it just toppled from there. Rolled twice, hit a tree with full force, kind of tacoed it, and it slid to a stop. Luckily it came out with no injuries, so got lucky. We'll go get it. Sweet. <laughs> far as we go with the trailer. This is where uh, the story of uh, Goldilocks and Three Bears is based out of, right here. Oh, let me tell you this. We were here like a year ago and we rescued a Jeep from this spot, like within the, you know, this area. And we had to move a rock and we got in trouble for moving it. And they called us and they said, can you please put that rock back when the snow melts? And I said, you bet we can. And now uh, we're here after the snow melts, we're gonna put that rock back. So we've actually got two jobs up here. We've got to recover Alexis and we've got to move a rock. So the rock, when we were up, when we moved it out of the way, it was right against the hill. And I was like, let's push it off. Well, Matt said don't because they might want us to put it back and they <laughs> did. But we sent Tucker up here on a recon mission to like check it out when he was up here visiting his family and uh, he says somebody's pushed it down. So we've got to get it from down anyway. Somebody went and did it without me. down to the main road. Or you could just drive it that way. It ain't gonna drive. Instead of trying to winch it up, we could just winch it out. Down to the lower road down there? Just drag it out there? Yeah. That's quite a ways down there. Yeah. Let's go down and look at it. Yeah, we're getting all sorts of poison up in us. Well, there's your problem. As far as... Okay, it's gonna roll. It's gonna roll? Just fine. You did a good job. If, um... With this? <laughs> right? I think I have an evil plan already in place. There's a little inchworm. They're here again. Worms are here. <laughs> right there. Okay, Skeeter. Yeah. I need one soft shackle and one rope down here. Okay, so here's what I'm planning on doing. I'm planning on putting a snatch block there. When we pull this over like this, it's gonna want to roll down the hill if it's in neutral. 
So we're going to tie it to this tree so it can go, but, but not all the way down there. If it works, that would be amazing. So Skeeter, I need you to find me a snatch block, a tree saver, and a soft shackle. And just get those items out. I'm coming back up. Oh, we got a climbing aid. Yeah. Whose idea was this? Tucker? Get your own climbing aid today at mattsoffroadrecovery.com. And you can actually let your own out for a minute. Okay, we're good. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready! Okay, he's ready. Okay, go. Is that too much resistance? Nope, you're good. Okay, you are hooked up at a wapo. Skeeter, is there anything weird that's against? No, keep going. I'm going to watch it for you. It's okay, keep sliding. going. It's working. Yeah. Your plan is coming together, El Wapo. Keep going. Okay, let off a little bit, Matt. It's working. There it goes. That's what we wanted. Yep. Woo! It worked. Un unhook that, Skeeter. Okay. What do you call one of these trees that's dead? What? It has been. <laughs> okay, Skeeter. Why don't you rappel down there? I've got the wrong vehicle there. I should have the more bear posted up there because it's got a little bit of weight on the banana. And I think I'm going to be pulling off of the banana and a tree uh, yeah. to do this. So we'll see. Yep. Some people would say, Matt, how do you know this is going to work? And to them I say, I have no idea if this is going to work. But give me a few minutes and I'll tell you. Going back down. Thanks, Skeeter. Yeah. Scratched a little. Mine are. Yeah, I got sore. pants on. And I've been, my <laughs> shins are scratched. So Let's go. Legs are itching like crazy. A lot of triangles of death here. <laughs> All right, I've got to get in a position where I can see what's going on and I won't die. Oh. All right, man. All right. We are not heavy enough up here to do what we need to do down there. So it looks like we can go down. None of those rigs are heavy enough to pull this up there. We know for sure now. So we're gonna tear this all down. We're gonna regroup. Looks like there's a path down from this. So Skeeter's gonna go scout that out, but we just don't have enough lead to do what we need to do here. Today we're taking the low road. All right, so we're gonna leave this rig out here and just take that one unless we need to come back and get this one. Roger. too bad this is not that bad i'm sweaty okay. yeah you ready for this skeeter skeeter ready I can. I wish I could have got the this, but it went so fast. Holy crap, Tucker! Your your life flashed before my eyes. <laughs> yeah, what'd you see? I saw you move like I never seen you move before. Well, he yeah, kept. I figured he was. A, he'd at least run into the back of the more bear. Yeah, That's what it looked like, and then he oh, and then he just started. Oh. <laughs> okay, Tucker. 
Can you grab this rope and pull it back up through the front? You should have wore your brown pants today. Stop. This is all sweat, I promise. I saw, oh, here goes the more bear. And then I, yeah, I thought saw Tucker running. Because I'm like, Lizzie, go, 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 go. She's like, <laughs> and Tucker's like I thought this. For, I thought for sure he was going to hit it, so I sat there like this. Like, oh, no. <laughs> OK, Lizzie, pull nice and easy. Back up and just bump it just a little. Okay, bump it. Okay, well, twice that much. Okay, go. Stop! Parking brake on. I guess it was the rope that stopped. How you feeling right now, Lizzie? Well, I can't tell if my heart is beating faster or not, which it I shouldn't be doing, but this is a ton of fun. I'm loving this. This is awesome. <laughs> Crank it to the left. Through the left, to the left. All right, guys. Let's go again. If I start flying off the mountain, just let have her stop. I know, but the vehicle's already damaged, Skeeter. How's that tether working? Yeah, it is. Realized we were gonna have to walk out of here. <laughs> we interrupt this sketchy job to do another sketchy job. See, we were here last year and we had a Jeep down this road and we couldn't get it over this rock and it was this gigantic rock. And so we ended up moving the rock out of the way and Trevor wanted to push it down the hill. So, but I'm like, no, don't do that. That's not nice. They might want us to put it back. We didn't put it back. We should have, but we didn't. Then somebody come along and helped us because we sent Tucker up here to do some recon. Somebody pushed it off. The reason we were even here or we even care about it is I got a call from a park ranger who said, hey, we watched the video. We need you to put that rock back. But it was winter when that happened. So he's like, wait till the spring and you can do it. So here we are. If I say I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. You don't need to keep reminding me every six months. <laughs> To be completely transparent, the park ranger was amazing. He's just like, we really appreciate you getting that Jeep out, but we do want that road closed, so would you please put it back? And I'm like, yeah, absolutely. Oh, it's a road closing rock. Yeah. That well, makes sense. Extra one in. There it is. Where is he? Oh, were you looking for worms? There's a little just worm. one specific worm. A residential worm. The, the, one. the biggest worm, the huge worm. Oh, oh there's, there's, a baby. there's one. He's had baby. That's cool. Yeah. Lizzie loves worms. Mm -hmm. There was a big one there. It was like this long. Mm -hmm. I'm like, this, this big, big around. <gasps> so this is a day job and we showed up here in the evening. It's currently six o'clock in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. We still have a three and a half hour drive home. I can't tell you this, but that thing's a lot heavier than you think. Oh, I know how heavy it is. We've winched it before. 
we, first rodeo we done this. Rock. Us and this rock have history, Skeeter. Skeeter, I'm gonna need you to check your attitude. <laughs> I'm just telling you, that thing, we ain't gonna move that. At the door, there's eight of them right there. I know what to do. Yeah, All right, nice. this is my second chance to make a plan that works today. So I'm a little nervous, but what I'm thinking we're gonna do is we're gonna hook to that rock with these two pieces of equipment and we're gonna pull it up. We'll see how that goes. Hey Lizzie, pull it in. Okay Lizzie, just bump yours for a second. I think Skeeter's right, that's a heavy rock. I'm trying to get it to flip, but I'm probably not rigged right for that. Let's let's redo this here. Okay, Lizzie, pull up. It's okay. You guys watch those. About to come off that hook. The most frustrating thing. Because I want to pivot the top this way first. Whoa, 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 whoa. We, we got to keep that angle or it's going to slide off the top. Just, Lizzie, just go again. Stop doing it. Do it in. Rock. You got us this time, Rock. We'll be back. I think this is a job for the heavy wrecker. This We're just pulling these rigs off. We need a more comprehensive choking system for the rock. Yeah, we got some trash cleanup we did. Yeah. It wasn't a total bust. Yeah. All right, so we momentarily failed on that. Now we're back at the other task that we're momentarily succeeding on. Let's go do that. How are you driving this thing? Like they do in uh, Australia. They're practicing for when we go over there? Yeah. You're looking like you're kind of going to go off. Uh, trying to steer to the left. Oh, I can't get it open. Almost killed you, sucker! It's sucker! For that T! That was nice of him to apologize. Matt was done with the slow! This way it's just digging in more. Yeah, I don't want to budge. Well, that definitely made things worse. How come I can never just make things better? You only make things worse. Worse. Bear. I 
wonder if we should try to load it here then. I've got a plan for loading it. because he's so strong and manly. Oh, dang! <laughs> it's not Matt laughing. Oh, it's dude. something happened. We didn't need those covers anyway. Well, it's been a great day. It's been a long day. We're all tired and we are starving. We took some damage, but we handed out some damage too. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I watched the whole thing go down and I never saw Tucker come back up. So I'm looking at Trevor scanning his face and Trevor's happy and running down there. But there's still, there's nothing from Tucker. Tucker's and he's behind everything. And I'm like, shaking. is Trevor in shock and Trevor, and Tucker's dead? Laughing at Tucker's demise. <laughs> it 